On the second day of competition on the powerlifting stage at the Rio Centro Pavilion 2, there were eight women in the up to 45 kilogram final, with China's Hu Dan Dan, the world record holder, tipped to take the gold medal. In the first of three rounds, the Paralympic record changed hands three times. Zoe Newson from Great Britain lifted 98 kilograms. Nigerian Latifat Tijani took it to 101 kilograms. Hu Dan Dan then improved on that by one kilogram. Great competition in the first round, with two lifters breaking the 100 kilo barrier. In the second round, 24 year old Newson produced a superb lift of 102 kilograms to move into second place. Tijani failed in her attempt to lift 104 kilograms. The Asian Paralympics gold medalist Hu Dan Dan improved the Paralympic record once more with a successful attempt at 105 kilograms in her second round. In the final round, Poland's Justyna Kozdrik made a last-ditch attempt to move into third as she attempted 101 kilograms. This despite not succeeding at 98 kilos in round two, a bold but ultimately unsuccessful effort by the pole. 34-year-old Tijani threw her hat into the gold medal ring in the last round with a massive effort of 106 kilograms. Thus regaining the Paralympic record and equaling the world record, which had been set by Hudan Dan in February. But the 27-year-old Hudan Dan was undaunted and added one kilogram to the bar. A successful lift of 107 kilograms saw her improve on her own world record, set a new Paralympic best, and claim a first Paralympic gold medal. And she decided to push her boundaries further with a fourth lift to try and improve on her record. And showed remarkable power and strength to complete the lift and set a new world mark at 108 kilograms, a fitting way to end a highly competitive category. Gold for China's Hu Dan Dan, silver for Latifat Tijani of Nigeria, and bronze for Great Britain's Zoe Newson. All three women breaking the magical 100 kilogram barrier.